Now, there are many contractions, as you know, but there are some contractions that end in what? Who knows? Quite a hand. Who knows? Some contractions end in what? Belly? Contractions. Some contractions, specifically since we're talking about double negatives, end in what? T. N apostrophe T. N apostrophe T. As soon as you see the N, you should look at all of these Ns. Isn't that funny how negatives, they all start with N. A lot of them start with N, 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 N. Negative. So, N apostrophe T is a type of what contraction? Negative. negative contraction. It's a negative contraction. Give me some examples. Hands. Give me some examples. Michael Brown. Hands. Hands. Anyone else? Marcel. Don't. Don't. Anyone else? Vanessa. Should it. Should it. Oh, there's so many. I'm glad the light's on. You know these. You know these. Yes. Shan't. <laughs> well, no, it is one, but it is one. That's fine. That's uh, British English. Yes. Doesn't. Does not. Okay. Let's break these down into the two words. Can't is what? Cannot. Don't is what? Do not. Should it? Should, Should not. not. Right. Let's skip. Um, well, shall shan't not. is shall not, if you didn't know, for proper English, British English. And doesn't is? Does not. Okay. There are so many more. I know that you know them. It's wonderful. So, what types of contractions are these? Who can tell me? What types of contractions are these? What types of contractions are these? This one I haven't heard from. Where are my popsicle sticks? Right here. Can I do oh. Can I pull them? Manasa, go ahead, since you're the closest to it. Pull a popsicle stick for me. Kyla? Negative. negative. Everyone, they're negative what? Contraction. Contraction. Anytime you see what? And a positive What kind of contractions? A negative contraction. I can't hear you. Negative contraction. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, here is the activity with a partner. Okay, don't eyeball your partner now. Listen for the instructions first. With a partner, you are going to turn a double negative into a correct sentence. Okay, a double negative sentence is a sentence that has how many negatives? Two. Two. Okay, is that right or wrong? Wrong. It's wrong. Okay, take one negative out and exchange it for a positive. positive. Okay, so <laughs> this one, it's slang as well. This is slang. Okay, <laughs> ready? And I need some actors on this one. I Who can who can who can act it out for me in their seats? Who can who can read this one for me in their seats? A little uh, attitude. Uh, Kilea. I ain't got no homework today. No lie. That's right. <laughs> okay, now who can do the translation? Preferably in a British accent. Let's have someone up a quiet hand. Let's have someone I haven't heard in a while though. She doesn't Well, you just got here. Okay, yeah. Yes. All right then. <laughs> Okay, very good. So, if you look at this, if you look at this, okay, we changed the ain't. Ain't is actually slang, but you will see it in a dictionary, maybe a slang dictionary. You want us to refrain from using ain't, okay? So, I don't, okay, that's what type of contraction? Negative. Negative. It's okay as long as I have only one, one okay? I don't have any. I replace no with any. any, okay? I don't have any homework today. Seriously, instead of saying no lie, I said seriously, seriously. okay? <laughs> so, do you get my drift? Yes. Is that all right? Yes. All right then, eyeball your partners silently. And when my hand goes down, I want you to switch with your partner or go to where your partner is, quietly, 
And begin, you'll have five minutes to do this and act it out um, if we have time. Okay. okay. So I need two, just two examples. Two examples, two translations. Okay? Two examples, two translations. Go. A woodchuck can't chuck no wood. What? <laughs> I said a woodchuck can't chuck no wood. Okay, translation. A woodchuck can't chuck any wood. Okay, okay. Thank you very much. You may have a seat. There's one way that you speak at home or when you're with your friends, okay? But then there's academic language and when you go out in the real world, the language that we speak. Both of them are fine, but if you want to be successful in life, you have to speak according to the standard, which was your translations, okay? At home you can say, yeah, okay, I ain't got no blah, blah. But when you come to the workplace, when you come to school, use a translation. Okay, turn those double negatives, switch them around, make sure you have a negative and a positive. Okay, just to wrap up, okay, I'm going to pass out these activity sheets, my volunteers, my um, distributors. Okay, we're going to wrap this up. Eyes, eyes, eyes. All right, everyone to their seats. Quietly. Thank you, distributors. You're welcome. Okay, may I have your attention, please? Look at number one. Who can read number one for me? Quiet hands. Who can read number one? Troy? A negative word means. Who knows what a negative word means? No. Destiny. No. No. A negative word means no. Repeat. A negative word means no. Okay, number two. Who's going to read that one? Uh, Kilea? Okay, and can you fill it in? Positive. All right. What does a negative word mean, boys and girls? No. No, a negative word means? No. No. Anything that has negative, any negative connotation, that means? No. No. Okay. Go ahead and finish the rest. You can refer to your notes. And uh, we'll go over it when you're finished. Okay, there's a contraction section in part B. You can use your notes or you can go from memory, but check your work. Okay. I'll tell you what the homework is later. Just kidding. <laughs> All right, thank you boys and girls. You're welcome.